would be self-defeating because the same people who want to keep guns say they want to solve mental illness. Yet, if mental illness is solved, then who would be left to vote for the candidates they want? Ooh, got him. <laughs> for the most of the public conservative voices in this country, the idea of any control, no matter how small, baffles them. As Ben Shapiro demonstrates in oh. this clip. The Justice Department, within 60 days, will issue a proposed rule to make clear when a device marketed as a stabilizing brace effectively turns a pistol into a short-barreled rifle subject to the requirements of the National Firearms Act. Okay, this particular provision with regard to stabilizing braces, apparently there are 10 to 40 million stabilizing braces in circulation. Basically, a stabilizing brace is a device that you attach to the end of an AR pistol, and it straps to your arm, right? It doesn't strap to your shoulder. That would make it a rifle. Joe Biden said yesterday that it makes it more deadly than a rifle. I have, I have no idea where he's getting this, uh, or as deadly as, as a rifle. It makes it more accurate, maybe, um, but really it's there to, to kind of prevent the recoil from being as large. I mean, I think like the reason Ben Shapiro talks that quick is because like he's so like he's afraid that if he stops, then he'll spontaneously combust from all the pent up sexual frustration he has in his system. I, I like to think that somebody has a gun to his head. That's why he talks. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, th th this arm strap thing, it'll, it. it'll, it'll make it. It, it, it. There's no way it'll make the rifle uh, more accurate because yeah. uh, if it does make it more accurate, then the guy pointing it at my head will certainly kill me if I don't keep saying all this bullshit. Right. <laughs> watch it, watch his eyes. I think he's blinking out in Morse code. Help me, help me. I, I'm not sure. But... 